Welcome, 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 YouTubers, to another edition of Dancing Clay Quick Fire Interview. So, go and big up yourself, Dancing Clay. You don't know you're the leader in sound system online culture. And big up yourself, I'm really cool, my girl. I'll be your host today, Shawnee T. Now, who we have here? One of the greatest sound systems. There's many great sound systems, you know, but we're talking about a column in sound system, you know. When the sound turn on, down here, you feel it in London, and that's real talk, people. Let me introduce to you Father Quaker from the great Quaker City Sound. Bless. Yeah, respect mm -hmm. that. Bless, man. All right. So we got this quick, quiet interview we're going to do. It's going to fling some questions your way, yeah? And we're just going to compensate, yeah? No problem. All right. So, brother, let me ask you first of all, what inspired you to start your sound, and, and what year? Why? A cops and start me if you start, so yeah, yeah you know. And I come around. And I come around uh, the twenty second of July nineteen sixty six. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I make this on and start. And why it caused me to do that is that <clears throat> I used to collect music in the early days. Yeah. My brother used to send music from Jamaica up to me. Okay. And I have a stockpile of records, they play in my car. Yeah. And I went at a dance at uh, Avalock Road School Room. It was Canterbury, they call it. Go listen, the sound from London in Cox. Huh? Mm -hmm. And three sound from Birmingham Duke Sonny, mm -hmm. Lord Cali, and Duke Neville. Okay. And I went in the night and Boy, I'm going terrible. <laughs> <laughs> so, true me is a burning man. I said to them, say, my cousin, I said, boy, I'm going to build a sound to represent our town, you know. Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. And so said, so don't you just start from there, so. Okay. Mm. You see, and why it comes so quick is because from Jamaica, yeah. I was involved in sound. Okay. Which sound in Jamaica you was involved in? Quaker. Okay, from back home? Yes. Okay. We, oh, tell me, which part of Jamaica was that? Then? It's a Mantigonian. Ah. Born on Grove 48, Born in Street. Okay. Nice. And then we really have two champions sound there. Mm -hmm. Quaker. And another sound. The Mighty Trojan. Okay. So, when Reed and Cox and Tom the Great Sebastian mm -hmm. and Miller can hear them sound, they come from town. Yeah. I was a little boy around five areas. We used to go to dance down a wharf. <clears throat> we used to wrap up the clothes in a plastic or wrap the banana and go swim off over a reef and come round. Okay. And go wash off and put on the clothes and go in at the dance. <laughs> see. So from this the sound business, you know? Okay. Mm. So that's where you got your name from? Quaker? Quaker, the sound I follow. Okay. My own sound. Okay. So what, what kind of sound system is that? What kind of music you play? Me play now? Yeah. I play every formation of music. You know? Okay. So that's what the sound was built on all style of music? All style of music. Nice, nice, nice. And um, so where are you from now? Where are you from now? Where's the sound based out of now? Birmingham. Oh, okay. Which part of Birmingham? <laughs> And Zurich. <laughs> it's important people know exactly where this sound comes from because I remember. And Zurich the headquarters for this sound okay. in the Midlands. Because me, it, it was just above my generation, but my bigger brother and sister used to, mm. you know, what I mean, go and dance back in the day. You understand? And one thing everybody spoke about the heaviest sound on the in, on the planet was Quaker City. Not really, you know. No. You, you see, I talk the truth. Mm -hmm. I give you the truth. Yeah. There was a sound did heavier than me. Who that? Metro down beat did heavier than me. Yeah. But I look at sound at a different level. Mm. Right. Metro did heavy but it made very, very rough. Okay. I was heavy with quality. See. And that's uh, that was the difference of us. Yeah. You know? But pound to pound. I was giving more weight and the quality more than the nice <laughs> okay. of weight. See, see. You understand? Yeah. It's like today you hear the sound them they play out there. 
the base are nice. Okay. The proper weight, the proper base is supposed to drop. You feel it. When it hit your man, you feel good. It not hit you and you feel pain. See. True. True. So, you used to clash back in the day? Plenty. Yeah? And oh. that we live on. <laughs> and <laughs> that we live on. You know? So, can you remember your first sound clash? First time clash? Who your clash Why Well, it's a history, you know. Mm. I don't think it happened to no sound man. It happened to me. The very first night me come out of the road to come play sound, me come in a come buck up in a man and call cold fire from this rabbit. Okay. And it was a whole time sound man in it, years before me know about it all than me. Mm -hmm. And I come bump in the in that night. Yeah. That's my first night. And when it finished, it's Sunday morning. He come over and he said to me, he said, you man, he said, Ross, boy, you play some music here tonight. <laughs> and he look for me and he wind up in face and he said, you're going dangerous, you know. See. And that man never leave me side until he go back to Jamaica and pass away. Okay. Yeah. Nice, nice. So would you say that's, be, that's your, your, most, your best dance? You have, you have... No, no. Okay, so you can name some of your best dance? You should do that. <sighs> boy, I tell you something. I don't, I don't see the, I don't see a sound in England here. Play with the type of sound in what I play with when I come around. Because when I come around, <coughs> it was danger. You have some dangerous sound was on. Okay. Which sound? You have sir D's. Mm. And you have people that talk about them sound there. You have fans so. Lord Coos, Cone Shelley. Yeah? Yeah. Then Duke Reed. Cocks and them used to move monks. Yeah. Yeah. One of the sweetest sound that ever come out in a London and did have it but not at a very high standard. Yeah. Was it enchanter, never enchanter. Okay, yeah, yeah, we know about them sounds. Yeah. Yeah. Well he would do one of my pattern as uh, as youth of you know, because in everything you do, you have to have a man you mug yourself off. Yeah, for real. But I come and I was so greedy, I mug myself off a tree, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most you so much strength, brother. Yes. Definitely. I, I mug myself off a cox, hmm? mm -hmm. because of his style of when he was playing the music. Yeah. I mug myself off a... Um, metro because of the weight section. Okay. And I muggle myself off uh, the enchanter with the weight and quality. Yeah? yeah. So I take little of the three of them mm -hmm. and stuck with mine. And that's why when Quaker City come out in sound system, it was so fierce. And it, so is that the, that what you say? What that's the main thing. That's your, the main ingredient to be a good sound. The main ingredient to be a good sound is three things. Yeah. <clears throat> you have to have record. Mm -hmm. But it's not matter much. You have to have a damn good sound that speaks for itself. Mm -hmm. And you have to know how to play it. That's the key. So them three things that is powerful. Yeah. It don't make sense you have record and the sound no good. It don't make sense you have sound and you can't play it. Mm -hmm. Like most of what's going on today. Definitely. So um if you could play if you were to keep a dance, if you were to keep a dance today, mm -hmm. which sounds would you would you would, would be would you play with? Is there any sound out there right now if you play? No. Even, even from the past. Even. From the past? Even from the past. If you can bring back a moment. Mighty Sufferer. So okay. Is that song. I, I play with him. I love to play me and him play again. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Toby is not too bad, King Toby is. Would you just play alongside him or you like to clash them? Like, like back in the days? I play with all of them in a clash. Yeah? Yeah. Nice.
all of them in clash. Nice. And they don't give me no trouble. Okay. Because, ah, boy, I tell you, self praise is not all about half his speech. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's the truth. <clears throat> it's the truth. In the days when I come out in sound, I was lucky to find Neville Enchanter because he's the man make me have a sound. Because when I decide to build the sound, yeah. I build it, a guy did in Birmingham and legs the giant. Good amplifier builder. And he built me a hundred and we come on the street. Mm -hmm. And around five, six months after, Neville Enchanter tell me, he says to me, he said, Carl, you have music, you know. But you know what? You know, I know my son. And I said to him, say, I'm gonna uh, planning to be like to step up from 100 to 200. And he says, Don't build a tabernacle. When you go and build it, come and carry you and my builder. See. So it was like <coughs> I'd find myself into a bucket, a gold bucket. Yeah. Because one of the greatest, <coughs> greatest amplifier builder that ever lived on this planet is a man near Herald Pretty Long. Yeah. Yes, I am Bill Neville Enchant Arms, Toby's Arms, Reed Arms, Cox Arms. That's man Bill me Arms. Yeah. Nice. So we did have the cream of the cream. <laughs> so it would be very hard to go out the road with a song like that. Yeah. I make any boy I take no liberty. <laughs> it could not. Yeah, for real. And the power was on me as well. When no sound man away from Neville could I do. I was the only sound man and Neville who design our own boxes. And that's where the key of his sound comes from. Okay. Because we create the sound what we want. Mm -hmm. The quality. The quality. Yeah. And the type of speaker we use and the size and the depth of the box. Okay. Nice. So alright, so we spoke about the quality of your sound. Let's talk about the, the music of the sound a little piece. Can you remember your first complete you that you cut? Yes, <clears throat> all right. He cut, when he got giant tubbies, he cut a dog for the, the sidewalk doctor. Mm -hmm. yeah. And that tune from Glen Brown in bathroom, skunk. Okay. So, what's your top five dog, you would say? My top five dog? Yeah. But that's what we have to say. No, that's why they get everybody in the house. Say, boy, because I have so much dog plate oh, okay. and so much dog work, they are a very high standard. Yeah. So, we can I couldn't pick. <laughs> I couldn't. <laughs> I couldn't. The yeah, world yeah. is dangerous, you know. Mm. All right. Um, <laughs> so, if you had the chance to do everything all over again, would you ch would you change anything? <clears throat> no, I wouldn't change anything. What 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 would I change? I would, I think Lady did mention that thing one time. You know, I thought Council did mention it one thing. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Sound system should be in a league. Okay. And the league is like a football league, Division 1 and Division 2 and Division 3. Yeah. And the reason for me to say that, in the 60s, they have youth comes in a sound, but born and come up in the 70s, then come and come start a little sound and things. Mm -hmm. And it's like, they start on Monday and by Sunday, they, then set them at the top. Is the people supposed to put you at the top and you? Then use them out. Yeah. And it, it kill the business. Mm -hmm. So if a son did register, yeah, and then you're in a league, you have to play your way up to certain standard and go to a league division one and <laughs> or the bottom of division two. Yeah, yeah. Then, you know, you could have class. But anybody these days, I mean, how much city in England around around 50, 60 yard city? Mm -hmm. And each city just think say you have a two, three thousand sound in each city. Yeah. A whole heap of sound that you know. And every man think say them are the best. Yeah. And at this end of the day, it's not. It's a black couple out of it. So so what's your what's your so let me let me touch a little bit first. So what 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 are you really thinking about the real condition of sound systems when you hear them nowadays? What do you what do you what do you what do you get from them? 
<laughs> a big joke. It's the biggest joke me ever see. Yeah. And I don't know why. You know, it I tell you the truth, I love it till I love sound I love sound till I don't I can't tell you. I love it. But you know sometimes nowadays I start feel say I feel shame. Okay. No serious. I feel shame for go to the road and go hear some song and hear people play. I would piss on them if you hold them if they was on fire. See. Because I know sound that. Mm. And what the guys are not today is doing, they're using PA equipment out there. They kill off people, they death you. You go dancing here by earplug virgin. See. I joke something that. Yeah. You know? Mm. So me not, me, not, me not rate it. Okay. And not until the day them play with a proper sound to put on some beating upon them and tell them where they go wrong, you know? Yeah, not gonna change. Mm -hmm. And it have to change. Mm -hmm. I hear you. So, so what's, the, what's the future for you? What's the future for the quicker? Have you come a long way, you know, because you're a column, <laughs> you know, you're not, you're not, you're not king, you're an emperor. No, well, you see, but I'll show you now. <clears throat> I would have to go and keep dancing for myself. Okay. For people to hear me song. Mm. Because the people of today, I'm telling you, blood, they scared, they're afraid stiff they go they go play play I. Right now. Whether London, Bristol, over the whole country, man afraid when they hear Quaker City man, it's like then then they piss themselves in them shoes. Mm. Because they just feel sick. Why? What else? Because we did put a scare against against everybody. Yeah. And a serious chat. Yeah, man, a big strong sound, man. Every yeah. man, every man feel the hands of Quaker City sound. Especially London. Because when we when alright, there's no sound system in England. Not in London. Out of London. Ever go to London and make London feel free. We make that land and land and man afraid. <laughs> Every Jesus Christ one of them. From Lyle Cox and Toby is the whole of them. Yeah. Yeah. So when them, you know, them talk, if you talk the truth, they don't have to hide it. This country sound and make them feel. Even when they come out burning on, the whole of them, they're mm. afraid. I mean, never play a song from land and yet, and there are not two of them to play together because them always carry. Need a man box with them. <laughs> <laughs> and you never see no box one Quaker City box. Mm -hmm. But you already see another man with them sound box for it and another man mm. Well true you know, because I tell you the truth, you know, they Quaker City is a sound that every every original sound man they talk about and they have total respect for you. you know? Well they will have to, you know, because we just it's a message we was doing. Mm -hmm. Deliver the proper message. Yeah. And we still they do it and we still can't do more. There's a lot of things I see in sound system tomorrow morning what can come out of the road and make this man feel Jesus Christ that could happen. Mm -hmm. But you can you know, I just have to hold it. Well, maybe I have to go show it to my youth before yeah. me pass away <laughs> quick. But there's so much to do to sound. Yeah. Now I use half of it around ninety three. Don't do it much because what? I don't have no time to keep dancing because nobody not keep dancing and call quick because they're free Yeah? yeah. And let me tell you the truth. Where I leave sound system is the same place it is. Don't care who you are from Jamaica, they'll come to England, come play sound or just a place across mm. the world. Nobody no left no standard of sound system. It's still just the same. Even the music and then they play, nobody no make no new rhythm. Yeah, same thing Coxon was saying, you know. Well, there you are, like yeah. it, they talk the truth. Yeah. Same thing, not no change. Mm. From Mr. Harold and Tony, pretty girl, tap the amplifier and leave it, the few I'm about there. If you go around the world, you know, everybody wants Harold pretty girl equipment. See. So you see, you're talking about around the world. You play around the world? You play in different countries? No, no. No? No. You see, I would love to, but I'm one way. I would have to bring the set. Because that's me. Mm. 
it's no point you're gonna call a sound man from which part of the world bring him into England and when he come he come play for somebody else's sound okay. and bring few records who is he? he's not the sound man that mm. So as I said to Dan, there's certain prestige in my self and my son and he carry. Yeah. It's just like you going out there and have this silly thing what they call sound clash. And we go you find one son and five man come from all parts of the world, so then they play music. And tomorrow I say, boy, me hear this man come from Japan or this man come from America could kill a sound last night. When kill the sound with <laughs> and I want sound in it. No, I don't think that's stupidness. Yeah, yeah. You know, but I don't love it. I don't love it. Bring a set. Go up there and string up. It's funny, you know, you say that because, you know, the Dan Sinclair platform, we, we keep our own little clash. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And it'd be lovely to see you come on there and clash somebody. And set it up. Yeah. And the way Jesus is right out be there. <laughs> <laughs> we do, we document sound system culture. It's not it's not like on a waste thing. It's no. it's more on a on a on, a, on a entertainment vibes and an education. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, when I say if I go, I I do get offers to go to places to play. Mm -hmm. I get quite a few offers, but I make it clear. Right? It's yeah. not even gonna provide a set for me to play when I come, or me gonna contain my things and come and play. Yeah. But if you come and play and somebody equipment with them, I won't do it. Okay, well if you check the format that we have, we just play 15 dubs, one for one, that's all we kind of play, but it's more of a nostalgia kind of thing, because I sound like, a great sound like Quaker City, you could only play certain sounds for us, because most sounds you're like you. So you have to find somebody on your level, and your standards set high. Well, bring it come, you know, yeah. because why me no want me is not a walk over. <laughs> the world knows that, but me not a walk over. Mm -hmm. I'm a very serious sound system mm -hmm. operator. Mm -hmm. Me no yeah. skin up blood. Yeah, yeah. Me have the Jamaican yard attitude in me playing. Yeah. Me no water down yet. <laughs> you hear that, people? No play with Quaker. Listen, from then time to now, you cannot me play no with Quaker. Down. You no. cannot play with them, you know. Jeez. Yeah, so, that's serious. Outside of the music, you do any. You, um, what else do you do? Outside of the music. Me is a trade man, you know. Me is an engineer, you know. Ah. At a very high level. That's the only two things me can know. Me do good on planet Earth. Yeah. Okay. I'm an engineer and I mean know it to a heights. Hmm. I mean a sound system and I mean know it to a heights. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So. I know you've seen the work that Dan Sinclair does on the platform. Do you have a do you have a message for or anything to say about the work that they're putting in Dan Sinclair? Keep on roll it on. Yeah. I look for it with Dan more time because he's a man. <clears throat> Dan remind me of Tubbies. Mm -hmm. right? You could have gone in high school and the builder. You could have gone in high school and you reason with him. Yeah. Suggest so certain things and him say. Yeah. I could try it now. And that's it. Yeah. And progress come out of it. Yeah, man, perfect. No. And from me and him talk. Yeah. Me vibes let me know so we can do something. Because mm. mm. for us it's so important that we that we show the world the, the, the foundations of sound system. Because like you say, there's a lot of horror kind of horror come up so yeah, yeah, yeah. but if it document your journey, your path, your path yeah. was important. You yeah. understand you? Well, I'm coming from the days when we have to make use a thing in Jamaica we call calbash mm -hmm. and break it in two. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And put on a, a piece of wood pan it around eighteen inches long. Get amateur start a generator in them days. Take strip it, take the wire out of it, stretch it across. Mm -hmm. Put a piece of wood at the end of it, to tighten the string, and we use it and play banjo. <laughs> we used to get the bass, mm -hmm. we used to have a thing where we sit down and make up with three keys. But the keys set up in a way that you have one hand and the other hand here, and it would go across. So you have three keys, but you get six hands. <coughs> okay. And a hole cut out in the middle. Mm -hmm. We call a rumba box. See. 
and you can get a deep bass mm -hmm. and a deeper bass and a lighter bass. <laughs> dum, 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 dum. Yeah? Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. We used to go <laughs> and get bamboo giant, young bamboo. Yeah. And cut it, black off one end, and put six soil in it and one at the top and blow it as a five. <laughs> See where the mercury is, see where they come from. So mm -hmm. not even Mr. Cox and that and all them and them are town man, then they do them, them, them <laughs> something then. Yeah, yeah. Yeah? yeah. And those things they used to use a hotel fit play. Okay. Yeah? Mm. Good. Go back again. You used to get the goat skin and you get a bottom of barrel and stretch the goat skin around it. Yeah. Put it out and throw water upon it, put it as sun and make it soft itself and stretch it more mm. until it tight and rub it round. Then we use whisk and tight round to hold it there. Yeah? And that we use and make the drum. See. So that's where the music they come from. And that's where the mental business they start. See. I hear you. Yeah? Yeah? Mm. And the man, when they read the man blues, them come from foreign, yeah, yeah, from radio, and Mr. Dad, they read them, bring it come. Mm -hmm. The man, them sing and play to it. So when you have people that say, rock steady, scab beat, the man, they never did name it the way they play the music to the thing. And a man come after and name it and say, boy, a rock, a scab beat, that, you know. See, yeah. Right? But it's a whole lot of dance was there before the scab it. Because they there the mentor, you have the cha cha cha. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right? You have the three step, you have walls, you have all the whole lot of things. Yeah. So the music come up, mentor, mm -hmm. scab it, then rock steady, yeah. then the roots music, reggae. Yeah. But if you look back on it, you know this scab it. Every music, even up today, if you listen to it good, you still have the riff of the scab because of that are the leading mm -hmm. part of the Jamaica reggae. Yeah. The scab riff has to be in there. Okay. And that scab riff had that, they come from the banjo, you know. Chicken, 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 chick, a banjo music that start that. Mm -hmm. Okay. People. People, you hear that? This is why it's so important to understand and, 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 to, and to be educated by your elders so you can have some foundation because if, it, it, if you don't have no foundation, everything you have will fall. Yeah? So on that note, I just want to say, respect Dada. Thank you very much You're welcome, for coming on Dancing Clear Platform. You're welcome. Thank, You're welcome. You. Thank you very much. much. I look forward to work with you guys yeah, more, definitely. you know? Definitely. The half have not been told. So definitely. Well, this is just a little piece, people, of the half, right? So, there we have it, people. The great Quaker City Sound, one of the cornerstones of sound system in England, right? And you ask any sound man, and they will tell you, if you don't talk about Quaker City, you don't know about sound, right? And that is a fact. So, right now, I just want you to big up yourself, Dancing Clear, and big up yourself, Unruly Coley. I've been your host today, Shani T, and this has been another Dancing Clear quickfire interview with the great Quaker City. Bless. Boom.